Abraham Lincoln. He is the 16th President of the United States. He was born February 12, 1809 at Sinking Spring Farm, near Hodgenville, Kentucky, United States. His father's name was Thomas Lincoln and mother's name was Nancy Hanks Lincoln. His father was a farmer and his family was very poor, living in a small one-room log cabin. While Lincoln was still very young, his family moved to Indiana and then again to Illinois. He only went to school for one year. But he loved books and learning and taught himself as much as he could. When he was 22 years old, Abraham Lincoln left home to work at a general store. It was there that he got his nickname Honest Abe. Once a customer accidentally overpaid by a few pennies, and that night when the store closed, Abraham Lincoln walked four miles to take the money back. In 1832 Lincoln ran in an election to become a member of the Illinois State Legislature. But he lost. After that he served as a captain in the army. In 1834, Abraham Lincoln elected to the Illinois State Legislature as a member of the Whig Party. Then he started working as a lawyer. After being admitted to the bar in 1837, he moved to Springfield, Illinois, and began to practice in the John T. Stewart Law Firm. He got married with Mary Todd on November 4, 1842, at the age of 33. He had four children. They are Robert Lincoln, Edward Lincoln, Willie Lincoln, Tad Lincoln. In 1846 he was elected to the U.S. House of Representatives. In 1860 he ran for president at the age of 51. It was a difficult time in the United States. The North and the South disagreed on a lot of things, and it was getting worse. One thing they disagreed on was slavery. The Northern states did not want any more slavery. The Southern states wanted to keep their slaves. Abraham Lincoln did not like slavery. In 1960, he was elected president of the Republican Party. Because he had the support of the northern states. He had almost no support from the southern states. As soon as he became president, southern states began seceding from the Union. That means they decided they did not want to be part of the United States anymore. President Lincoln was determined to keep the country together, and in 1861, the war started. It was a civil war. A terrible bloody war that lasted four years. On January 1, 1863, Abraham Lincoln signed the Emancipation Proclamation, an order that freed all the slaves in the southern states. A few years later, he helped to pass the 13th Amendment to the Constitution, which made slavery illegal everywhere in the United States. The Civil War finally ended on April 9, 1865. President Lincoln wanted to put the country back together and help the South rebuild. He is widely considered to be one of the greatest presidents in American history. His leadership during the Civil War and his defense of human liberty make him an American hero. His face is on pennies and $5 bills. He was included in Mount Rushmore and the memorial for him stands in Washington, D.C. Less than a week after the end of the Civil War, Lincoln and his wife were watching a play at the Ford Theater in Washington, D.C. There he was shot in the head by a man named John Wilkes Booth. Abraham Lincoln died the next morning on April 15, 1865, at the age of 56. He was the first American president to be assassinated. You cannot escape the responsibility of tomorrow by evading it today. Said Abraham Lincoln.